Happening now, a bird that inadvertently visited our state is heading south for the winter, but the brown pelican named RV had an incredible journey thanks to a small army of volunteers in our state. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Susanna joins us now live outside Meriden Markham Airport. Good morning, Roger. Good morning, Wendell. You know, the truth is I'm a little bit jealous of RV right now because RV right now is in route to Florida, Jupiter, Florida, to be exact. In fact, take a look at this video that we captured a short time ago. This is footage of the plane that RV is traveling on, actually taking off here from Meriden Markham Airport. This is truly an incredible story and kind of the beginning of the end of an incredible journey as well. RV is a juvenile brown pelican who was initially spotted by a member of the Audubon Society clinging to a floating dock in the Connecticut River. Now, that volunteer likely saved RV's life because brown pelicans don't normally live north of Virginia Beach, and experts think that RV likely hopped a ride up north on a ship that originated down south. Now, when deep officers arrived and actually rescued the bird, RV was suffering from hypothermia, and volunteers worried that RV would not survive. But volunteers at a place called Hope in Killingworth nursed RV back to health, and then this morning, a great mother-daughter volunteer pilot team, Laurie and Ariana Strand, agreed to fly RV to what will be the bird's new home at a wildlife refuge in Jupiter, Florida, and eventually RV will be able to be released back into the wild. So an incredible journey, an incredible story, and again, we're all just a little bit jealous of RV now because the beautiful bird is headed to Florida. Reporting live at Meriden Markham Airport, I'm Roger Susanen, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.